Hello and welcome back to my channel Eccentric Spirits Tarot. Thank you so much for being here with me. So I'm going to be doing the weekly tarot reading for Sagittarius. That will be covering next Monday the 17th of January until next Sunday the 23rd of January. And just like usual we will cover each individual day of the week just so that you've got a really good idea of what it is you can expect ahead of you next week Sagittarius. Okay, Sagittarius, I feel like next week is a week, right, where you, you, it, it's kind of like you can turn the week into anything you want, hey? I feel like you've got so much possibilities. I feel like the possibilities are endless, okay? And it's kind of like you can, you can take charge of the week and there's all this potential surrounding you to, to do with it what you will, okay? The only thing that's going to sway you from this journey is if you get distracted, okay? I I feel like there is a bit of distraction. It, it's kind of like you're looking all around, uh, maybe straying from the path a bit in a sense, okay? I feel like it, that's the only thing that's going to take you off course. Um, and it's also a week where it's like, you know, don't feel alone. Don't feel like you're all alone because you're not, okay? There's there's definitely one person in particular who who really cares for you and who really comes from a good place. So if you get that feeling of of being alone, just 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 take comfort in the fact that you're not, okay? This person really is there for the right reasons. Uh, Monday's got you in a place where I feel like Monday is a day where you're embracing you, you're embracing what you're feeling, you're embracing, it's like you're taking a stance, okay, it's like you're taking a stance on what you want, you're saying enough is enough to the things that are draining you, enough is enough to the things that are taking your finances, okay, and it's like this has put you in a position where this stand you're taking is is liberating you, it's freeing you, and it's removing all the pressures, okay, all the pressures associated with other people, all the responsibilities, the expectations, right? And these are expectations that it's more like, you know, that they're made by these people, not even by you, okay? And I feel like you're really getting this this rebalancing on Monday, okay? This, this sense where taking this stand is only benefiting you because it's just, you're just in it, okay? It's not like you're just saying enough's enough for no reason. It's like, you know, you can see that it's, you're seeing by the bigger picture, okay? You're seeing the bigger scheme of things and you're seeing past just the, the moment. Uh, I feel like Tuesday's got you in a position where you just need to trust in yourself, okay? Especially with those around you. There are some, some third forces at play, okay? I say forces for some of you, these are, are people. For others of you, this is is energies, energies being sent your way by people, okay? Uh, people with their own problems, with their own jealousy, with their own insecurities. I feel like most of it's stemming from jealousy, okay? Wanting what you have or what they think you have, their idea of what it is you have. Um, and, 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 and they've got their own motives, okay? It's purely coming from their own selfish place. It's, it's like, don't put your trust in, in everybody else on Tuesday. Put that trust in yourself, okay? That, not saying not to trust anybody, but don't rely on everybody else to tell you who's good and who's not, what's going on. Because, you know, it's, like I said, it's a day where they've got their own agendas. So it's a day to maybe not be able to trust everything that's being said to you. So I sense like Tuesday's really the day where the honesty is coming from within you, okay? Um, you've got the answer within. When you when you get that feeling, knowing, when you hear it, when you feel it, when you see it, whatever it is, right? However, it lets you know, just trust in it, trust in yourself, okay? Because you know, you, at the end of the day, you know who you can and can't trust here when it presents itself on Tuesday. Um, I feel like Wednesday's got you in this place where it's like you're chasing after what you want, okay? I feel like you are trying to get things off the ground. You're trying to get that break. You're trying to 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 really get what it is you're passionate about and get it out there. Get it out there amongst everyone. I, I feel like it's a day where... 
there are a few things weighing on you okay a few things that you've chosen to keep secret a few things that you've chosen to withheld but you've chosen this to align with with what you want you've chosen to withhold it because uh, it, it, it seems to be aligning with with where you go and what you want okay it's kind of like I, I'm sensing like some things are better kept in the past in a sense on Wednesday um, if that's making sense for you I'm sure it is um, and it's also a day where Thursday's all about regardless it's again it's like let that intuition guide you okay take that time go within assess what it is you want assess how to get there and do it on your terms don't try achieve your happiness on anyone's terms apart from your own okay and it doesn't matter how you achieve that Thursday's got you in a position where I feel like there's a lot gravitating towards you okay I feel like you're you're kind of drawing the energy I feel like you're keeping that even flow especially at home I feel like you're really carrying carrying things at home okay um, but this is something I'm sensing you do from a good place you do it because you you like to help people you like to help the people you love you like to look after the people you love I feel like all this is stemming from more from a nurturing place than anything I do sense like there's going to be something present itself okay I feel like there is something coming up on Thursday where it's okay I'm gonna split this on Thursday for some of you I feel like it's presenting itself for others of you I feel like time has lapsed and it's now like presenting the answer okay so for those where it's presenting itself I feel like there's this kind of there's a choice that needs to be made okay it needs to be made it's surrounding it's surrounding like locating it's surrounding a place and and I feel like for those of you where the decision presents itself I feel like things are in such a good place for you I feel like things are still quite harmonious for you that it's got you a bit unsure of what to do okay because it's like you have to pick one thing so but you don't have to rush into it either okay so for those of you where the decision just presents itself you can take the time if you want you know there is no there's no need to have it done by tomorrow kind of thing um, for those of you where it's kind of like that time's lapsed, I feel like this decision's presented itself already and I feel like you're now coming to a point where it's like the answer's being revealed, okay? I feel like even if you haven't decided it, it's kind of like a series of events has kind of decided it for you. Um, I'm sensing on Friday that you're, you're in this really good place, okay? I feel like you've got some solid relationships around you and solid relationships that can go into the future if you want okay that can go long term i do sense that at the same time as you being in this really good place i do feel a longing i feel a, a longing a pull to something that isn't anymore okay and 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 it's not taken away from where things are now but there is still a, a, there's still a love there okay there's still a connection there's still some cords connected and 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 there's a yearning okay i feel like for some of you there's it, it's kind of living in the moment but also replaying the past moment all at the same time if that makes sense um i feel like saturday has you in a position where okay I, it, it's like you've got the choice okay i'm going to split this in two i feel two big message two major things coming through here so the first one i feel like for this creative side of you for this passionate creative journey that you're on i feel like you're hitting a crossroads okay i feel like you're coming to a crossroads where you've got two options where you can continue or you can take a different path all right and i feel like this crossroads is presenting itself on saturday and and got you in a place where you know you are debating what to do because you've got other because it's it's like it's going to affect other people as well even if you stay on this path or if you detour it's like regardless there are other people involved okay so i feel like but at the same time i feel like whatever you decide is going to take you to fulfillment i feel like regardless whatever you do things are all going to align for you and align for you well whether you go straight or whether you turn at your crossroads for others of you i feel like this crossroads is more linked into a romantic partner okay and 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 i feel like it's linked into someone who is t really really friendly who is so charismatic 
full of energy. They'll be uh, a real people pleaser, real charming, okay? I feel like this person, there's a question for some of you with linking in with this person, okay? Whether to stay or whether to go. The worst thing you can do is continue when you're not actually sure what you're doing, okay? I feel like some of you want to commit but haven't committed. I feel like some of you haven't committed because you're actually second guessing if this is the path for you. Um, and I feel like, you know, if this is what you want, then it is time to give that commitment. It's time to dive in head first so that you don't get your heart broken as well as the other person's heart broken all at the same time. I feel like if it's not what you want to do, then Saturday's the day to make that decision. Saturday's the time to uproot, pack up, start again, if that's what's calling to you, all right? But again, it's like, it's not about just floating by because it's not just your heart, like it's you and someone else as well, okay? And and it's like, you're not the only one here. Um, Sunday's got you in a position where I feel like you are stepping into a really good place. I feel like it's, it's really got you focusing around your home base, focusing on your next moves and, and focusing on your next avenues, money making avenues. Okay. I feel like a lot of you are trying to bring this money making into home, bring it into your own, your own thing. I feel like some of you are looking down a whole new money making venture, a whole new path, a whole new avenue. And I feel like Sunday's really got you playing this over, looking at things, working out where to go next. Okay. Cause I feel like you do know that there's potential too. Okay, I feel like you also know that not only can you make it work, you can make it work and in your favor. I do feel like there is a big weight lifted off you on Sunday. There is a big progression. There's a, a growth in you which enables all this load that's been on you is just removed. I feel like all this burden that you've been carrying, burdens and dramas of other people around you and again of people you care about okay like i said i'm sensing this comes from that nurture inside of you but i feel like on sunday there's this real reprieve of it and it's like it's been taken back the universe has rescinded it all and it's like this load is lifted and you're able to actually stand tall and breathe again okay so i feel like sunday's gonna be a really good day for you and and, and a day of just following your journey, right? And, and healing at the same time because you're, you know, there's still a process for this burden that's being removed. Um, all in all though, it's gonna be a good week for you. So thank you so much for watching. I really, really appreciate you. Um, if you enjoy my tarot readings, the best way you can support me is just hit that like button, subscribe, comment. Um, and if you're new to my channel, please check out my channel. There is content coming out every day for you. And yeah, also that competition for the free tarot reading is almost over. So I'm 50, I think I'm like 40 something now, subscribers away. So as soon as I hit 1500 subscribers, competition's over. I'll be picking one of you for a free tarot reading on whatever it is you like. And all you need to do to be eligible is hit that, uh, hit that subscribe button and leave a comment. And yeah, I'll hit you up and I'll announce it on the community page as well. And yeah, in the meantime, most of all, thank you for watching. Thank you for your time and thank you for being here with me. See you later.